headed to Costco right now. I'm gonna share with you the top items you guys need to be picking up. And if you don't have a Costco membership already, you're definitely gonna want one after this video. Costco has some really great quality garlands. This one is pre-lit, it's nine feet long. It's pretty pricey, but it's a nice quality one. I was drawn to this wreath. I thought this would be gorgeous on a front door. It comes in a variety of colors. Costco has so many different outdoor items you can pick up to light up your home. I thought these LED birch branches were pretty cool. They're on deal right now, but you could use them inside in a vase or you could also put them in a pot, but you could also put them outside like on your front steps as well. I found the selection of wired ribbon to be pretty impressive. They have several options in the 2.5 inch size, a lot of different colors to choose from. These are in fairly large spools at 50 yards. If you're looking for some modern decor options that'll last year after year, I thought these reindeers were nice. You get a set of two for around $50 and you could put them on your fireplace or really anywhere. This set of trees for $3 and you could also put out these cute little gnomes. I was really interested in this glitter gem garland. Now it only comes with hundred lights and it's kind of pricey, but you're supposed to put it out in your windowsill. It's not very big, but a cool and unique item. If you're looking for something to put out in your front yard, these flocked LED trees are really cool. They're in a pack of two, and I just thought they looked really neat. They would also work really well as indoor decor. If you need to replace your tree, Costco also has pre-lit trees available. My top place to buy Legos is definitely at Costco. They have such a wide selection, and typically this time of year, you're going to save a little bit on the Legos. There was several Disney princess ones. There were some Lego friends. My kids really love Harry Potter and I find the best deals on the Harry Potter Legos here. I ended up getting both of the Harry Potter castles and I think they'll be perfect. This dollhouse would make a great gift as well. It's five foot tall and I love at Costco how they have it set up so you can see what it looks like. If you have a kiddo who's into American Girl doll, they have a couple of selections. They have the Welly Wisher and then they also have two other dolls that come with a complete outfit as well. I bought these sleds last year for my kids and they are awesome. If you're needing sleds, these would make such a great gift. If you have kids that are into poppets, this is a large one that would be fun. Video drones are very popular right now. This one looked to be affordable, although I don't know much about it. I have been seeing these Cabbage Patch dolls all over the internet. I know they have them out at Aldi's right now, but I found this pack of three for $19.99, which I thought was a good deal. So if you have kiddos into Cabbage Patch, that might be a good option for them. My girls loved Play-Doh. I thought they would absolutely love this set at $89.99. If you've made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Comment the word of the day, which is Costco. Now for your wrapping paper, Costco has a bunch of different varieties in the three roll section. You can get them for around $12. These gift tags definitely caught my eye. They're a little bit unique, a little bit extra, and would be so beautiful on your presents. They're $12.99 and you get a set of 84. If your kids are gonna be sledding or if you're going to be somewhere where it's really cold, I love these thermals. You can put them under regular clothes or snow clothes. You can get them in kids. You can also get them in adult versions. These are the knives that I use at my house. They work really well and they have a great price point. I also felt like this would make a really great gift for under $20. I love using silicone bags and they can be kind of pricey. I felt like this price point was good for a six pack of these silicone bags. They have the flat bottom, which is a really nice feature as well. You can put a variety of items in here and rewash. I recently bought these Pyrex containers off of Amazon and I know I spent a lot more. You get three here for $13.99. This Nordic Wear baking sheets caught my eye. It's a set of three for $25, but that's a really high quality set of cookware. 
These coffee warmers are so popular right now, Costco has their own version that you could pick up for Christmas. I thought these thermo flasks look like a great deal. You get a set of two and the price on them was great. They are on deal right now for $15.99. Now, if you've been looking for the Stanley Cup and don't want to spend the money, this is a set of two cups that are so similar to the Stanley Cup, the exact same design. You can pick the color that you want that works for you. I would probably go with the gray and green. So you get two cups for $26.99. These scotch scissors would be great for wrapping gifts and they're on deal right now at Costco for $7.49. You can get a pack of scotch tape for under $10. I also stock up on batteries this time of year. The AAA and AA Duracells are on deal right now at Costco as well. Recently, I came across these 3M claw drywall picture hangers and these are great. They leave minimal holes in your wall. I thought the price point on these was great for how many you actually get in a pack. Every year I always get a pre-made gingerbread house and I felt like this was a good deal at $13.99. Costco also has a ton of candy options in bulk. This is great if you're making gifts or just want it around the house. You can also pick up some hot chocolate bombs. And there was several different varieties of hot cocoa. I love this little pack of four and they came in these decorative tins for $9.99. This is so adorable. I found this advent calendar for dogs and I also found these adorable set of three dog toys. Let me know where you'd like to see me shopping next down in the comments and I'll talk to you in our next one. Bye.